Hello everybody, Average Gamer here, so, um, little public news plate here. So, um, recently I've been asked a couple times about different things in the game, so I thought I'd do a little how-to, right? One of the things was, someone wanted to know, how on the website can I look at some of my stats? And things like that. So, this is the page right here. So first thing, right, you always start with the MechWarrior Online page, etc, etc. Um, I'm looking at this through uh, Microsoft Edge. Um, if you have Internet Explorer, it still looks the same. On the top right hand corner, it'll say Login Profile and all that stuff. When you log in, it still takes you initially to this page here, but what you want to do, once you've logged in, is hit Profile up here. This brings you to, obviously, your account. See? Average Gamer. It's me! It gives you, you know, your ID and, uh, you know, my email address and all that stuff. How many hours I've played. That's how many uh, banked premium time hours I have, um, how much I have active right now, how much GXP I have, how much MC I have, and how much money I've got uh, saved up right now. Also gives me all my options on the right here to activate more premium time that I have banked. Um, I've got about a year's worth, um, and adding MC and all that stuff. Down here it also shows you all the mechs you have. Now it does not show their dynamic screen, their dynamic picture. It shows you their default picture from the store. That's why my Awesomes look the way they do, and all that stuff. So it goes through every single one of your mechs. So for me, it's all 109 of them. That's why I'm doing this a little faster. Got uh, quite the quite the little junkyard going on here. So people were asking me about stats and things like that. So first thing I wanted to do was show a few screens here. So the first one is credit. So this is where you want to go if you want to purchase. Um, here's all my winning stuff. I don't know why it says I purchased MC, but I didn't buy any. Um, so if you want to purchase MC and all that stuff, you go here. You go to email if you want to uh, change or modify any email information. Passwords, obviously your password information. Content, that's when you pre-order or you order packages. So, for example, this is the Origins 2C package. I had to pick four, four factions that I wanted because I got the, the Orion package, or the Highlander package. So you had to pick four um, same with uh, Resistance 1 and Resistance 2. Next one was Redeem. So this is where you put in if you're going to redeem something. You know, burr, 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 redeem. Well, um, can't try any of these codes. They're already redeemed. <laughs> nice try, though. If you if you tried. Um, then Forum Profile. So this is where my profile looks like. It never works. But you always go to User through here. It's It's weird. Then off topic. See, this is the weird part. It takes you into the forums if you click forum profile and then pre order. So, this is if you've any ordered anything. Um, so, for example, I pre ordered Origin, pre ordered Resistance, didn't order Wave 3 because fucking thing's too expensive. Urban Mech, Resistance. Um, I have the Timberwolf and the Direwolf. I have the ability to upgrade um, to the difference, to the, basically pay the difference. Um, so you can do the same thing with Wave 1, Wave 2, and all that stuff. One of these days I might get these four. I don't know. We'll see. What we're here for is this little button here, Stats. So first thing is Challenges. This is all the challenges backslash events that have occurred in MechWarrior in the last little while since you've you've started work, started playing the game. So I can go all the way to the bottom here. Um, so here we had... Uh, I think it was just a win a mech bay challenge or whatever. Yeah, then we had the Path to Victory um, event back in August. Uh, then we had the Lance ch tier. You had to be in a group of at least four guys. Um, all you had to do is win a match here to <laughs> on their their birthday, and uh, you get a cupcake. Um, get a hundred matches, you get a reward, things like that. So these are all the different events and all the different challenges that they had for the events. You'll notice that at the beginning, like, I have a lot of uh, X's. A lot of stuff's accumulative, which I like. I really like the accumulative scores and stuff like that, but unfortunately some of these things, like the points here, did not like them. Um, for example, some of them were you had to get a kill, an assist, and a win to get a point and things like that, which I wasn't a fan of. Um, so that's why a lot of these you'll see X's and 6's and 5%'s. Almost no double digits. Um... Yeah, here's where you, I think this one here, adder up, is where you could get a free adder if you got 50 points. But um, the way it was set up was really hard. Um, Prove Your Allegiance was really hard as well. I, I maxed that out pretty good. 
that was a community warfare one. Then here's all the looking for group things. As you can tell, I only got group two done. Didn't even get to three or six or eight because they just when they implanted uh, looking for group, um, that was a pain in the ass. All the different uh, two kid, uh, Bella two kid stuff. Um, I really wasn't in a group of people playing really at the time. Um, I was working, I think, during this event, so I only got it to 30 points. Yeah, so there's all the different challenges and all the different events and, and all that stuff. And you can see when I started actually playing a lot, and I started going to see 100%. <laughs> when I really started playing. So, this shows you all the events and what you've won, in case you're trying to think about it, right? Next one is base stats. So, base stats are overall... Oh, just your base, your base stats. So right now, my kill death, uh, my death, uh, kill to death ratio is 0.63. So pretty much for every one person I kill, I die twice. <laughs> um, accumulative, on average, the amount of C bills I get per match is 112,000. Accumulative, like on average per match, I get around 1,100 XP. My wins and loss ratio, so I have 1,087, basically 1,000 um, wins to 1,200 losses, which is pretty good. Um, experience, I've got 2.6 million experience. Sea bills, 45 million. Uh, kills, I've got 1,235. Deaths, 1,959. <laughs> 1 and overall, and then that's my met credits. Actually, hold on, I wonder if base deaths. Ooh, what is archived? Archive makes the screen flash and do a whole bunch of negatives. We'll go to current. So these are going to be our current mech stats. This might take a few moments to load here. Okay, so... Now none of this is unfortunately being able to sort. Um, kind of wish you could, but... We'll probably have to do this on our own. So it gives you every single mech on the left that you have ever played at least once. Okay, Mad Dog. Once. Um, well, once, once. Well, I only played those Jenners once. <laughs> yeah, I start playing them again. And it shows you how many matches you played, how many wins, how many losses, what your kill, what your, um, what your ratio is, or your kill to death ratio, uh, how many deaths you have in that mech, what that ratio is, how much damage you've done, how much XP you've earned, and what the total playtime is per mech. Now, I kind of wish there was a filter option. Like, for example, my awesome, my 8R, if you look, 188 matches. 0.53 ratio. <laughs> um, awesome, 18, my, as you can see, my awesomes are my, my, my favorite. Uh, 0.76 for winning. 0.68 for uh, for deaths. Eh, not too bad. There we go. Pretty baby. 218 matches. Uh, 98 wins. 190, 109 losses. So I'm sitting at 90%. My ki kills to deaths is 0.68. Not bad, not bad, not bad. So it gives you a nice round round numbers. Uh -huh. Timberwolf Prime, 158. <laughs> um... Did a little bit better in that, 0.86 and 0.87. My Timberwolf C, 72 kills for 68 deaths, not bad. 52 wins, 43 losses, not bad. Uh, Adder Prime, I only played once with it. <laughs> I did 25 damage. <laughs> is it damage on that screen, or is it... Yeah, damage. So, pretty good. Um, next one is your weapon stats. So it tells you how many matches you equipped that specific weapon. And it'll tell you, for example, how many times you fired it, how many times you hit someone with it, which is usually important. Like firing 800 rounds of AC-20 and only having, well, 39.9% of your rounds land. It's pretty bad. Um, so it shows you all your different uh, different pieces of info, which I like. So you get the, the inner sphere stuff down up there, then you get your clan stuff down here, which I really like. So this will be able to kind of chart your usage and see what weapons you seem to utilize the most, and then also see what weapons you're also the better at. Um, like, for example, um, weapons I'm the best at, I've never used AMS. <laughs> I've went with it twice and never used it. Um, accuracy, 7%. So medium lasers, I'm at 70%. 
yard large lasers. I've hit about 78% of the time. And that seems to be... Oh, 85% for uh, clay and large pulse. So you can definitely church your, your own little stuff here. Pilot module stats. Uh, none. Map stats. Here we go. So wins and losses. Holy crap, that's a lot of matches. One day... <laughs> Spend the entire day theoretically playing River on River City. Is that New River City or Old River City? It's got to be just River City in general. They probably replace it. It probably still includes, still, you know, does it. Uh, Frozen City. I've got a positive win ratio. Alpine Peaks positive win ratio. Terra Therma. That's right, Terra Therma. Got to play a little bit more on Karims and Straight to get a positive. Win ratio. Oh, what if archived is um, the old maps? Nope. And last but not least, game mode. There's only three game modes. So I'm um, just almost at an equal wins to equal losses for uh, for all three game modes. Tells you how much money you made and all that stuff. So this is how you access your stats. Um, kind of easy. You know, nothing too too fancy. Um, I will admit, um, I kind of do wish if you went to like weapon stats or even mech stats, you could filter it a little bit. Um, sadly, the only way to do that is for you to incorporate it yourself into a um, Excel document, probably. And I don't know, I don't have Excel on my computer. But I do have Google Documents. That might work. But uh, what the hell was that? Oh, movie stuff. That kind of looked a little dirty. But yeah, so this is how you look up your stats in uh, MechWarrior Online. Just a quick little video here, 12 minutes or so. Anyways, thanks for watching. See you guys next time on the battlefield. Bye bye.